Is this going to be an easy question? I don't know. <laughs> um, do parallel universes exist? Do parallel universes exist? Well, that's again a good question. Um, the idea of the universe keeps changing, right? It's one of these things where the word keeps changing. So universe means pretty much all we know. So, you know, in Newton's time, the, uni the universe meant the sun and, uh, I don't know, six naked eye planets that they could see. That was the universe. And then in the early 20th century, um, people realized that, uh, well, or, or bit later than that, people realized that this band of, of stars, or this milky band across the sky, this milky, misty band, which we call the Milky Way, was a, was a big disk of stars, of, of millions or billions of stars. And people thought, well, that's the universe. The Milky Way is the universe. So the word changed again. And then in the 1920s, um, Edwin Hubble, the American astronomer, discovered that the Milky Way was simply one galaxy among a hundred billion other galaxies, all flying apart from each other, you know. And then that became the universe. So the universe was a hundred billion galaxies. And what we're discovering today is that the word universe may be changing its, its, uh, what it means again, because nature is banging us over the head and telling us from many, many different directions that there is more than one universe. You can call them parallel universes, call them whatever you, whatever you like. The phrase that people currently talk about is the multiverse. But there appears to be more and more evidence from many, many different directions, that, that both, both observational directions and theory. I talked about string theory, but in string theory, uh, there are 10 possible dimensions. That means you can have, uh, um, you can, you can, I mean, and where, where six of those dimensions are, are too small for us to see. Well, that opens up the possibility of there being universes with five big dimensions and five small ones or seven big ones and three small ones. So, you know, that, that opens up the possibility of lots and lots of universes. But um, I, I do think we are on the edge of, of, of a, a, a change in our idea of what universe means again. And then every time this has happened in history, the universe has got bigger and bigger and bigger, and we have got smaller and smaller and smaller. So I think yeah, parallel universes or uh, other universes probably do exist.